Good morning. It is July 17th and it is the 35th day of harvest. I just came out to get started for the day and was told to go back to the trailer house because the moisture is too high yet. So not sure what the day is going to bring. Half of the family left though for uh, Dillon, Colorado and Taylor and Callie and Lane headed for the mountains for the day. Sort of kind of wish now that I could have went with them, but oh well. We'll see what happens in a few hours. All that's left of this little schoolhouse. Looks like maybe that would have been a stage at one time. Just think of the fun festivities that they probably enjoyed in here at one time. Gosh, if these walls could just talk. Really thundering though. Can you say love you? to the field and try it. If it's dry enough, 
all we can do is fill everything. So that's what our plan is. We'll just get trucks and grain cart full, hopefully. And that's just uh, more acres that are cut and in the bin. I thought I'd stop here at this field and show you. The Prozo is starting to head out. Just getting started. Well, wish us luck. Hopefully we'll get a few acres cut. Hopefully. Moisture tester on the combine is showing dry. It's showing anywhere from 9 to 12 percent, so it's should be good to go. Right here it's showing 70 bushel wheat. That's good too. Seventy bushel and I'm going four miles per hour, just so those of you who are wondering. Are you there, Tracy? We are we racing, Jack? Jim and I really hope that you enjoyed today's daily update. If you did, why don't you give it a thumbs up for us? We'd like to know that. And be sure to hit the subscription button and the bell notification so that you know when the next video is up and ready to watch. Thank you and we're so glad you're along with us for the journey.